Let's start today with Fox 59's Russ McQuaid, who spent his day in the courtroom. He joins us now live with the latest. Russ. Tyler Newby claims he acted in self-defense when he admitted that he shot Dorian Morrell once in the stomach on the morning of May 31st, 2020 on Market Street, just off Monument Circle. An IMPD officer and Tyler Newby's friend, Anthony Eads, both used the same word, chaos, to describe the downtown Indianapolis streets the second night of the spring 2020 riots. Eads told jurors that as he and Newby rounded the corner of Market and Pennsylvania streets near the Hilton Garden Inn just after 2 a.m., they felt threatened by a large group of people that surrounded them. While Eads says he was backed up against the wall by three people, he heard a gunshot and spotted Newby on his back on the ground with Dorian Morrell standing above him and clutching his stomach. Eads told the jury that he and Newby ran off before turning themselves into a Marion County Sheriff's Reserve deputy some 20 minutes later. Newby was frantic and felt bad, Eads told the jury. He saved our life that day. Newby's attorney said his client acted in self-defense. The prosecution rejects that argument and ask the jurors to find Newby guilty of murder and voluntary manslaughter. The state is expected to call some of the people that were with Morrell the morning that he was shot. It's not yet known if Newby will testify in his own defense. This trial is expected to wrap up on Thursday. At the City County Building, Russ McQuaid, Fox 59 News. Russ, thank you. We're going to stay on top of this trial as long as it takes to get a verdict. You can follow our updates every day at fox59.com and find our previous reporting on Newbie's case and on the downtown protests. It's all right there on our website. Again, just click on fox59.com.